This path will take us all the way through the mountain. My people used these ways until the Soviets arrived and began digging. What did they find down here? Enough to make them curious. They used machines and explosives to dig deeper. Did quite a lot of damage. Many of the old paths collapsed, but it's safe now. Or, it used to be. That doesn't sound good. Trinity must have found the old mining equipment. They're trying to finish what the Soviets started. And there's no other way through? I'm afraid not. Not anymore. This complicates things. What the problem? I'm scared. Shh, shh. The wires here are corroded, so I think I can bypass. Almost ready. They're gonna bring the whole place down. The Soviets destroyed much of the old paths. Those machines were not built for delicate work. We'll have to sneak past them. Yes, but we have to hurry. If they collapse the tunnel, we'll be trapped in here. Hey, we've got some serious structural damage over here. I don't think this tunnel is stable. Start the goddamn drill. We can break the tunnel later. Okay, here it goes. It's working. What are they looking for? They're trying to get into the ruins. Ruins? What's down here, Jacob? You'll see for yourself soon enough. I hope. Can you hear me? This is bad. Maybe we can get the elevator working. Gotta be a way out up there. Hold on! I think I can... Okay, okay! I can get power to that console! Well, we're not getting back from where we came. Now we gotta fix that lift. I know! Just... let me try something here. Damn it. The elevator's jammed. Crack one's rusted through. Okay, spread out. Find something to pry it loose. <sighs> On it. This should come in handy.
At your earliest convenience, please acknowledge these communiques. We have received no directive since the discovery of the ruins. Examination of the artifacts and scrolls recovered from the site continue. As impossible as it may seem, it appears we may have discovered the ruins of the legendary city of Kitesh. There are also numerous references to some kind of messianic figure. If I'm interpreting the texts correctly, he was a prophet who fled Byzantium sometime in the 10th century. The inscriptions say he carried with him an artifact of great power. For the time being, I have suspended normal mining operations. It is my intent to discover the truth behind this mysterious prophet. Could this be part of the lost city? We now have heavy equipment in place within the main cavern. We intend to gain access to some kind of temple, even if we have to rip down its ancient doors to do so. While hundreds of artifacts have now been recovered and cataloged, two guard crews have gone missing in the mines. I have personally questioned the native prisoners. They claim to have no knowledge of the whereabouts of the missing guards. And though we've punished them harshly, I fear they are on the verge of revolt. Too close. Separated again. I just hope Jacob's still alive. I don't know exactly where I am. That's rapidly becoming the story of my life. I'm fighting to survive, yet strangely, I feel hopeful. There are incredible ruins all around me. This must be part of the Prophet's lost city. But how much more is true? The Divine Source, could it really be here? shows the prophet preaching in Constantinople. These ruins are incredible. Comrades, it is imperative that you respond to my communiques. We are now in dire need of supplies and reinforcements. A full revolt is in progress, and the prisoners now control the excavation site and surrounding facilities. In the retribution, I have ordered mass executions of prisoners from the native population. With any luck, these rebels will lay down their arms and surrender to save their own countrymen. No. There's tons of rock and ice in the way. 
we're lucky, we get out of here, it might get a few bursts of static and assume we're still alive. So, we're on our own. All the more reason to find a way out of here. It is clear to me now that our communications have been sabotaged. You likely have received none of my cables for quite some time. But I will continue transmitting as it is my duty. Local natives attacked us on multiple fronts soon after we attempted to sway them with the executions of their countrymen. There are far more natives than we ever anticipated. It is clear that they come from the other side of the mountain and have been preparing their revolt carefully for years. We are now without power and water, and winter is upon us. Those of us who remain will soon be leaving. We have one train transport that we will take with us as many records and artifacts as we can. Someone tried to get through this door before. There by the mirror. Yeah. 
this makes sense. If I follow these directions... gold sword hilt inlaid with jewels. This belonged to a Byzantine noble. Hmm, the blade itself was snapped off at the base. Did this happen in battle? Any who received this message, I will soon be dead, and with me all knowledge of this place. Escape for us was never an option. We boarded the train and set out for the long journey, only to discover that mere miles from the mountain, the tracks we built upon the backs of so many dead had simply disappeared. For months now, the native population has carefully dismantled the railroad, intentionally isolating this place in preparation for their attacks. And like their precious ruins, I will soon be taken by the snows and forgotten.
That should work. Shows the exodus of his people from the deserts of Syria. They settled in a hidden valley and built a great city. Katash. To protect the city and its people, the Prophet raised an army of warriors. But what is this showing? It's not the divine source they're holding. It's something else, something else, but what? And his warriors forged for him an atlas. That the prophet might always know his city and its secrets. A map of the city. It could show the way to the divine source.